Hello class 3rd welcome again in the science class Today we will do the revision of lesson 4 as it was completed in the last video that is the common insects The point number 1 is telling that the body of an insect is divided into three parts head thorax and abdomen it means all the insects have the three parts in their body so children remember that from today if anybody will ask you that insect have how many body parts then you will tell that these are three point number 2 is about the chitin insect's body has a hard outer covering called chitin ki insect ke body ke andar koi bhi bones nahi hoti because they are having the chitin a hard outer covering The point number 3 is about the speciality of the insects that insect have the six legs for being in the category of insect it is always must that they should have the six legs and compound eyes insect have the compound eyes do you remember that compound eyes are made up by many simple eyes and many have wings not all the insects have wings but many insects have the wings now the next point that is point number 4 is about the life cycle of the insects we were studied about the life cycle of the butterfly but remember that the life cycle of most insect not only of butterfly of most insects includes four stages that is egg larva pupa and adult first of all the insect gives egg and when the egg hatches larva produces and then larva converted into the pupa and from pupa the insect emerges the point number 5 is about the definition of social insect it can be asked you that what do you mean by the social insect or it can be asked that write the definition of social insects so you will tell you will write that insects means social insects are the insects that live together in colonies children do you know that all the insects cannot live in colony so they are not the social insects in the category of social insects only those insects will come who live together in the colonies and having the work division between them the next point is point number 6 it is telling about the three kinds of ant in an ant colony as you are knowing so they are having the three kinds of ant in their colony the name of them are the queen the worker and the male ants point number 7 is again about a social insect that is bees the three kinds of bees in a beehive are beehive means the colony of bees in which three kinds of bees are there the first one is queen the second are the worker bees and the third are drones drone means male bee the next point that is point number 8 is about that where the honey bees make their hives honey bee har jagah apna chhatta nahi banate where they will make wo apna chhatta keval wahi banate hain jahan par bahut sare flower ho it means honey bees make their hives where there are plenty of flowers because they need the nectar of the flowers and they converted that nectar into the honey is sold in the market we can purchase it the next point is about the usefulness of the insects some insects like honey bees silkworm and lac insects are very useful to us as we get products like honey wax silk and lac from them do you remember that honey and wax are given by honey bees silk is given by silk worm and lac is given by lac insect actually lac insect gives the lac resin the point number 10 is about the point number 10 is telling about the house flies and cockroaches that why they are harmful to us it is very simple because house flies and cockroaches can sit anywhere they love to sit at all the dirty places and after that when the germs stick in their legs or in any any parts of their body 
they can harm us because the same house flies and same cockroaches can sit on your food too and very easily they will transmit the germs from their body to our food and definitely when we will eat that food we will fall sick the point number 11 is about the remedies for insect bites it means if the insect will bite you then what the steps you should take the first one is apply an ice pack to a bite you are having the fridge at your home take out the ice cubes and apply it on that calamine lotion can be applied it is available in the market the third one is an anti allergic medicine can be taken it is the medicine after eating you will get relief in swelling and itching point number 4 is telling that in case of insect bite you can apply the vinegar lime juice or toothpaste on that area it will help you to reduce the itching and swelling point number 12 is actually about a way by which we can protect us from the mosquitoes it is telling that we should never allow water to get collected and stagnate in and around our house as mosquitoes breed them already i was told you ki jahan kahin par bhi pani ikattha hota hai aur wo pani mein movement nahi ho wo still hota hai us pani ke andar mosquito apne एक्स को देती है उस एग में से न्यू न्यू बेबी निकलते हैं एंड आफ्टर गेटिंग एडल्ट वो भी मच्छर बनते हैं एंड एंड दे आर एबल टू ट्रांसमिट द डिजीजेस सो वी शुड अवॉइड दैट देयर शुड बी नो वाटर कलेक्शन नियर एंड इनसाइड आवर हाउस द नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज अबाउट द फोर वेज टू प्रिवेंट इंसेक्ट बाइट दैट हाउ वी कैन प्रिवेंट द इंसेक्ट बाइट so one by one we will discuss the first one is that our doors and windows should be fitted with net agar hamare darwaze khidki par net lage honge so how they will come second is insect repellent creams should be applied these are the creams available in the market when you will apply it on your open body surface then it have a smell which the insects do not like so if they do not like this smell then they will not sit on your body so they will not bite you the third one is we must sleep inside mosquito net it is again because in the mosquito nets insects cannot enter the last is we must never tease insect definitely if you will tease them they will get disturbed and they will bite you for their protection children it was all about the revision of lesson 4 the common insect Thank you